Hi guys, I'm just coming in here to say that I am going to be doing a free giveaway, okay? So if you watch to the end of this video, you will get the details of the free giveaway. We can pretend that we're just friends, yeah, but who are we kidding? Hi everyone, it's Chi here. Welcome back to my channel. Okay, so in this video, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be testing out and comparing a very cheap shampoo and conditioner from the supermarket so something like about uh three four dollars they're normally about that in the supermarket and then recently i bought like a middle of the range sort of price uh shampoo and conditioner from the supermarket as well um and that pricing was around the 20 dollars mark each for each bottle but it was on sale for 50%, so I ended up buying the, the expensive one for $10 each. And then, also recently, I've decided to buy like a really expensive hair mask. Okay, I didn't get the shampoo because it, it's way too expensive for me. And um, so I'm just gonna use the middle of the range shampoo with the hair mask. The hair mask uh, retails at $60 a pot, but because I bought it in bulk, it's about forty dollars. Okay, so we're gonna take we're gonna take the retail price for each product. Okay, so it's about we're comparing a four dollar uh, shampoo and conditioner to a um, twenty dollar one to a fifty nine dollar one. Okay, so that's what we're doing in this video because I want to know if, once and for all whether buying a more expensive shampoo and conditioner is actually going to give you like great hair because that's what we all want right great hair this is my the condition of my hair now so what i did was i recently bought um the middle of the range shampoo and conditioner and so i got it for ten dollars each and I've been using and I'm washing my hair um, for about, I think twice a week, for about two or three weeks now. Okay, so I'll just show you what they are. I normally use this one, the Palmolive Naturals, because it's got the aloe vera in it. I'm a big fan of aloe vera. So I use this one with the shampoo and the conditioner normally. That's my, my normal go-to in the supermarket, right? But I real I think that it dries up my hair way too much. Okay, so that's the cheap one. The middle of the range one is this one. It's herbal essence, sulfate free, potent alloy, and manuka honey. Real botanicals, nourish and moisture. Um, yeah, and then then you've got the shampoo which is basically ultra, mo mo ultra moisturizing shampoo. Okay, so that's what I've been using. So I did wash my hair last night. And so I'm not gonna re-wash it. I'm just gonna go in the shower, I'm gonna wet my hair. And then I'm gonna be using this, this particular um, really expensive. Um, this one was basically, I've one of those adverts on Facebook. I'm a big, big sucker for these adverts on Facebook. <laughs> okay, so um, it's called Georgie Main 10 Minute Hair Mask. That's retails for $59 a pot. And then I, I got it for 40 because I bought like three, three of them in a go sort of thing. Okay, so you're supposed to leave this on for 30 minutes, I mean 10 minutes but I'm gonna leave it on for 30 minutes because I've done that also with this one. Okay, so, so this one here, this one is the one that's a cheap one. I would say the condition of my hair is like about a four and a half out of 10, I would say. That's the, it leaves my hair really dry and not very nice, okay? This one here, the, the, the middle of the range one, I would say that leaves my hair, and that's the condition that's in now, about a five and a half out of 10. 
okay I don't feel that it leaves my hair that that great but it's it's much better than the cheap one um, so five and a half for that one and I am so hoping that this one is gonna like make my hair look like a goddess <laughs> oh dear all right so let's have a look have a look at the condition of my hair so you can see that it's I've actually like dyed it like I stripped it because I had to like bleach it to, to get it to this color because my hair color normally is very black and so yeah I went a little bit blonde to be honest there's some bits that have been blonde and so yeah yeah you can see that it's still fairly dry I don't this hair here is basically me washing it and then just leaving it to t to dry overnight and then in the morning I'll put a straightener through it okay I didn't have much time to put a straightener through it either I just I was rushing in the morning and I just put whatever the straightener through it and then I just put a tiny bit of oil on top of it and that you know when I when I finish and this is yeah that's the condition so I just I'm hoping and praying that this mask would do wonders for my hair because everybody needs a miracle mask <laughs> I'm gonna brush my hair with a detangler okay so this is what it looks like I'm just gonna take this off Okay, so I mean it's just, it just looks like a normal cream to be honest. So you're supposed to put it on to towel dried wet hair. Alright, so here we go. Oh, it's, the texture of it is very rich. It's like, um, it's almost sticky. Yeah, look, I've used the other one, the middle of the range conditioner, and it's not this thick. It's thick, but it's not like this. This is really thick. Wow, okay. That's really, really thick, eh? Hey? Wow. Okay. Wow. That's okay. I'm impressed with the texture of it, actually, to be honest. I'm sort of rubbing it through my hands before I put it on. To so make sure you can put it on your ends. That's the whole point of it, isn't it? Wow, you should feel this texture. It's like double the, thick, the, the richness of what I normally would get in my conditioner. It's really thick, hey. Okay, that's all I'm gonna use. sort of feel like there's a lot of moisture in there <laughs> it's all over your hands I guess it's almost oily yeah wow okay make sure you get it all on your ends hey okay so I'm gonna leave this in for 30 minutes and then I'm gonna wash it out Okay, I don't have like a cap or a whatever. I'm just gonna leave it in a towel for 30 minutes. All right, so my initial thoughts after getting out of the shower, it was easy to rinse out. It wasn't very hard to rinse out. Um, I think, honestly, I think that my hair, the condition of my hair is gonna be pretty good. I just, that's the feeling I get from it. Um, I don't know what they put in it, 
I have to maybe do a little bit of research onto what they put into it, but um, so far so good. So, <laughs> I'm quite happy with it so far. Let's see what happens once it dries out. I've decided to blow dry my hair because it's quite wet and I don't want to get it bit wet here. Hi guys, I've just woken up. I've slept in my hair that I washed last night and conditioned with that hair mask. And um, I feel like, actually, I feel like I'm really happy with this product, hey? It's just so good. Now, the hair, my hair is still messy because I haven't actually um, done it up, but I'm going to do it up now with a straightener. Um, the thing that I actually feel is that the hair, my hair is in a lot better condition than what it was before I did the mask. Okay, it's, it's like 10 times better. Um, it's a lot softer, like it's really soft and it's not as dry. And I reckon if I use this for like a, I don't know, a month or whatever, I would be very very happy with my hair so the next time that I do my hair or wash it I'm going to put it the kinky muck through it and see how it holds just without um, just with the kinky muck because that's how I style my hair sometimes I just put the kinky muck through and let it dry naturally and my curls I just want to see how my curls will react to that my natural curls okay so I'm just gonna like put the straightener through it now now, when I do my hair, I don't like to put products in it. So, you know, it's just me. I don't like having lots of product in my hair. I don't like chemicals, period. That's what it looks like before it's actually even styled. Um, yeah, the condition of it. I believe is a lot better. It used to be so dry. All right, let's see what this does. As well, which is what you want. You want healthy looking hair. Okay, so that's that. And now I'm going to just put some oil on it. My hair, the, the feeling of my hair is so nice, seriously. So, it's so soft and silky. It's just, it's like, I feel like I've just stepped out of the hairdressers. I really do. I feel like I've gone to the hairdressers and they've just cut my hair and they've blow dried it. That's how I feel. The hair feeling so good. You can do this at home, just 30 minutes at home. But obviously, putting the strain through will take you 
it takes me normally about 20 minutes. Today I reckon it took me about 10, 12 minutes. Okay, so the real test is whether anyone notices anything about my hair, okay? So we're just gonna, we're gonna, gonna see if anyone notices the difference in my hair, if any, anything at all. All right, so that's the end result. Putting the straightener through. All right. Besides the curler, this is the best product that I've ever used on my hair, I would say. The mask. That mask, I don't know what's in it, but it's awesome. Hey. And I can, that's just after one wash or one, one soak with the conditioner. It's so like a mask, so it's like a conditioner. But um, I can imagine how hair, your hair would be after like a month or so. Look at that. All right. There you go. Hi guys, I'm back and I just wanted to show you the condition of the hair two days after I washed it with this mask. And so I've slept in it now two nights and this is the condition of my hair. And I've not done anything with it except put like the, um, the tangler through it, like that, okay? So this is the condition of my hair, just the one usage. after two days. Okay, so you can sort of, you can tell that it was so different to what it was before. Remember when I showed you in the beginning before I actually did the mask? And the condition of it was just so bad. <laughs> it was so dry, yeah. And now it's so much better. I can't wait to actually use this again. So I'm gonna to wait to tomorrow um, where I wash my hair. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do it again for another 30 minutes. And then I'm gonna see just how good it is. And what I'll do is I'll do an update for you in like, um, I don't know, maybe three months time or a month's time or something, just to let you see how good it is. But I am so happy with this product. It is amazing really is and I've got no makeup on at the moment so <laughs> you know how if you if you do your makeup it makes your hair look a lot better but I don't really feel like it's a fair comparison if I do that because the first video didn't have any makeup either okay guys for the free giveaway what I'm doing is I'm giving away a free jar of this mask so what if you want to be in the running all you got to do is hit the subscribe button there's a little red subscribe button at the bottom there and you just have to write a comment in the comments below this video okay um, i'll be drawing out a random a prize winner at the end of may okay 2022 all right guys that's it there's the product review hope you enjoy and uh don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button if you like this video Okay, see you later. Bye.